on ya! Come on in and watch this! Come here, This one! Atlas sent me here for some old man winter. You haven't been around here long, have you? What makes you say that? Because <laughs> eh, you're the only one of us who don't smell like the reptile house at the zoo. Now be quick about it and just take the winter. This ain't the goodwill. Just what we needed. That was the last of it. Now you think you can manage the repair? Sure. Whereabouts of the foreign bitch scientist unknown? Ryan presumes she's dead, but our guess is she's gone underground with the little sisters. Options on obtaining the ace are dwindling. Who did this? Hey, 
to me!
of CO2 poisoning the moment we turn the thing on. Well, not the perfect phosphor frequency, but it'll do. Okay, that should stop it from overheating. Everything's fixed. We're ready. Let's fire it up and see. First Lady Mark II was built around a particle lift system just like all the buildings in the city. I read all about it in the Columbian Scientific. The particle seated at the top of the structure must be up that lift. Perfect. Seems like a lot of technology just to float an airship. Comstock never heard of hydrogen. The First Lady Mark I did run on hydrogen, and it was destroyed by a single bullet from a Vox sniper. Unfortunately, the Prophet wasn't on board at the time. If I take the active particle, then the First Lady is just a 40-ton paperweight. Here we go. Now let's head back through that tear. You honestly expect Atlas to honor his side of the deal? No, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. How do you plan on handling Atlas? He ain't just some spliced up maniac. He'll make a mistake. I just have to be ready to take advantage of it when it happens. All for a girl you barely know. How well did you know me when you came to Columbia? Nothing but trouble that way. Best to head straight back to Rapture. Pretty lady not finished yet. What? Open the tear. Power for device, very expensive. Need for that? Just tell me what you want. So Jung wanted something as simple. Lock of hair. Oh, you're not serious. Not your hair, stupid. Think Hodge's secret lab. Mothballed, forgotten. In there, hair sample. In jar. Cannot miss it. You get for Sutra. Then, everybody friends. Where is his lab? Closed off past Fink's quarters. And you smart lady, you find. Should have seen that one coming. Right in the middle of the siege. 
means the other you and I are probably inside the factory. On our way up to the First Lady. And what happens if we run into ourselves? We won't. How do you know that? Because we didn't. done me good service, but I will not hurt the boy. I will see Fink and Comstock burn, but I will not hold the son to account for the deeds of his father. You've misunderstood us. We neither asked you to harm the child. Nor did we promise that yours would be the hand that would set Comstock's world afire. A famous man once said. And a famous man shall say. I may reach the mountaintop. But I fear I shall never visit the valley below. But you mean I won't live to see the... No. It's up to you what matters more. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Someone is coming. She'll arrive a girl. She must leave a woman. And what makes the difference between a girl and a woman? Blood. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Turn her into a killer? How? Give the girl no choice. And she will be forced to make one.
you just picked up? My guess is that it has something to do with that giant clock out there. And that clock has something to do with opening the door to Fink's lab. It's <sighs> not gonna work. I better take a closer look at that clock. A giant clock? Sort of. Looks like the mechanism unlocks certain activities when Fink gives his blessing. So what? We're stuck waiting for the cuckoo to go off? No. We've already found the clock key. We can manually wind it. Open whatever door we please. Sure seems like a lot of work to lock down a few doors. You know, if there's one thing Fink loves, it's a lot of work. Idiot, his lock of hair. Listen, I got you your gun. I'm here for my ass. But my book of the wit died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My book of the wit was a hero to the cause. Look, are you there? I miss you. You were the only one who ever... You were my only friend. Look, I'm not even here. I'm a projection of your own. Could you humor me then? Please. I think Booker would miss you.
Jesus, it's ripe in here. Say, somebody, uh, fetch me a millionaire to clean this mess up. To what? A killer. Yeah, well, mission accomplished. I'm no martyr. How did you do it, Booker? How did you... Elizabeth. I'm not Booker. And neither am I.
Seems like Fink and Su Chong were sharing their research. Like the Lutessas. Cross reality collaboration. It all makes a kind of sense. The little sisters and the big daddies. Sombra and me. Constants and variables. It's a wire mother. If you separate a gorilla from its real mother, it will imprint on almost anything. Even that. Why would Fink care about that? Songbird. He wanted him to imprint on me. Well, if I recall, that was a problem he solved. Skeletal formula for oxytocin. That's the chemical that bonds mothers to children, women to men, and songbirds to little girls. Apparently not. Fink dismissed it as an unsuitable vector. These poor things. Fink couldn't get them to imprint, so I left them to die. Imprinting failed. I can't be right. Clearly they formed a connection between Songbird and me. How? I was so young, I... I always remember him just being there. It must be a prototype or something. Is it a human? Does it matter? Hypnotherapy. On the songbird. How'd that go? About as well as you'd expect. he was in some sort of fight. I waited there thinking, thinking, I, I don't know, that something would happen, but, but he just lay there, moaning. I couldn't just... The line with the thorn in its paw. So much for science. I should have just left him there to die. I should have just... I will never escape it. Exploited, exploiting, me, Comstock, you, Sally. It's like a wheel of blood spinning round and round. Well, this must be the genetic sample Su Chong wanted. He 
sent you all the way back here for a sample of your own hair? He doesn't know I was once the child that imprinted on Songbird. But to him, all the answers lie in DNA. Men like Su Chong mistake an ounce of empathy for a pound of science. <laughs> See if anything's worth reappropriating. Check for stragglers. Spread out. Anything that looks halfway there. Lousy trait. Over here! Sega Lake! Uh, since when did you become Lord and Master? Used to do for the man. But now at least I do for myself. Going on. Can I find you?
she doing here? Don't think you can hide death to you. oppressors! Daisy really even had a choice. What do you mean? Right about now, I'm planting a pair of scissors in her back to protect a child she was never going to harm. She chose to die for her revolution. What about me? All the endless words, all the infinite possibilities. Did I ever even have a choice? Did. Look where it got us. Right back where we started. All these infinite universes. And yet we end up just going down the same paths. No one take your meaning. My father sold me to settle a marker. Comstock locked me up in a tower. And I sold Sally for what? Revenge to prove a point? And yet, here you are, settling the debt. And say we find her. The old past they managed to leave. Isn't it too late for her now? Well, I'd say that's up to her to decide. Just as coming back here was up to you. Rapture runs on children. Little girls with gold growing in their bellies. I'm not gonna break any cycle. Lucky, maybe I can dent it. Just a little. Pretty lady put hair sample in two. Then, business is finished. What's going on out there? Bloodshed, violence, but not relevant to our arrangement. Put the sample in two. Chong, we had a deal now. Open. Do you know what they call someone who enters a man's home uninvited? A thief. Am 
I do not remember inviting you into my city. I had a deal with Su Chong. Yi Su Chong is my employee. It was not a deal he was authorized to make. What do you want? I granted Atlas and his thugs asylum. You serve those same men in a desire to escape from my generosity. If they shall not have asylum, then they shall have liquidation. Give a parasite an ounce of charity. He'll demand a pound. I'm just looking for a girl that was taken from me. A little sister. I don't claim to understand what you are. But I know that you are special. There is business we can do together. And so, I give you a choice. Work for me, or die with Atlas. I'm not going anywhere without that girl. If it's a little sister you want, that shouldn't stand in the way of commerce. I've got dozens of them. I won't leave without her. My men stand ready to take down the door. In 60 seconds, they will enter the room. They will either treat you as a valued employee of Ryan Industries, or as a thief in the night. 60 seconds. There must be half a dozen of them or more. I've got to get ready. No traps. I, I can use the plasmids as traps and, and, and seed the room with them. i got to find somewhere to hide and, and surprise them. Take them down one by one. Estimate you, Elizabeth. People always do. Forty seconds. You know what I see on your face? Uncertainty. Who is this girl to you? Thirty seconds. Do you know the value of the shark? Without her, she would be littered with the detritus of the weak. The men who come for you have much in common with those great animals. What sharks do for the ocean, these men do for rapture. Twenty seconds. I will tell you something you already sense. Atlas does not honor agreements. And Orion does. I cannot save your Sally, but I can save you. Child, you're not a hero. You're not even a parasite. You're just a room. And Andrew Ryan has no time for rules. Do you know how much trouble you caused me? Nothing 
personal, sweetheart. There's the girl. Personal, sweetheart. I beat your sharks, Ryan. The better man won. Isn't that the only thing you respect? Now let me the hell out of here. What's your plan? I can't just place the particle on the ceiling, it would just tear right through it. But every building in Rapture was submerged into the ocean on the lunette ring, connected to the junction of its load-bearing supports. That's fascinating and all, but if you haven't noticed, Ryan sent his goons to murder us. If you're gonna pull a rabbit out of a hat, now's the time to do it. Looks like the structural junction is in Frank Fontaine's office. If I can get there, I can float the building. It so happens I've taken that bastard's office for my own use. I'll make sure you've access to the private elevator. Now hurry. Thought it was a good plan. 
Jedi. Time to pay the piper, sweetheart. Supposed to be a brunette. Anyone seen her? Look around! The rest of Atlas's crew are barricaded up an elevator shaft. When the backup arrives. We'll go in and take them out easy. Targets, you get me?
Ryan said the girl's gonna die first. What was that? Sister, you won't get anywhere hiding. Don't think you're better than me. Right, <laughs> Forget it. Not in the mood for this hide and seek. I know. And I'm ready. Are you sure? I sent myself here for a reason. Didn't I? And who exactly are you speaking to, Miss Comstock? If I were less acquainted with the vicissitudes of genius, I suspect I would question your sanity. I know so little of you, but I imagine the more I learned, the more exceptional I would find you. You know Atlas will betray you. And what are you? My best friend? You're one of a kind in this world. Or others. And now, your misguided sense of altruism sends you to your doom. It's like watching Isaac Newton die in a house fire. A vain attempt to save his cat. There, there, there. All the load-bearing columns come into this room and they meet... They meet there. I just need to place the particle in that junction, activate it and the whole structure should rise. There's no plan B. Might as well just get it over with. No cause for alarm. She's well sedated. So, it's begun. The cashmere's all blown to hell. 
If Ryan didn't know we were back before, I'm sure now he's got the message. What do you want with this one? If anybody's got the line on the ace, it's her. Find out what she knows. But no quackery. She's no good to us with a halo and a set of wings. I can start it as soon as the chloroform wears off. Don't see her as too tough or not. you're talking about. Look, we had a deal. Where I, is the ace in the hole? I told you. I Sodium falpentol. Are you familiar? <clears throat> no. Truth serum. Unpredictable stuff. <sighs> Too little, nothing. I have Too nothing to tell the you. Subject I don't even know that. what an ace in the hole is. Ah! I am still playing with the dosage. This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made, and men who make it. for you too. I tend to your own knitting if I were you. Now, darling, being that you were Su Chong's lab assistant and all, why not tell me where me ace in the hole went? I don't know. As I said, I'm no doctor. But that doesn't mean I don't find the field fascinating. I keep up on all the medical journals and the like. I hope you have someone to help you with all the big words. You know what part of the brain free will comes from? Stubbornness? the prefrontal lobe. Now, I think it's fair to say you're a bit of a stubborn one, are you not? A man named Steinman taught me this. He's a bit of a lunatic, but a fine surgeon. He calls this little trick a transorbital lobotomy. Take hold of her, lads. You're wasting your now, time. If you won't remain still, I can't be held responsible for what comes next. Here we go. You feel that? I'm moving the pick across your eyeball. Oh, still now. And resting it on your skull. There's about a bit over a quarter of an inch of bone between the pick and your prefrontal lobe. And that's where this little fella comes in. I don't... Shh, shh, shh. It was just a wee tap. But I don't expect it'll take more than a few of those to reach the meat. And then we might find you a bit less the mule. Where's me ace in the hole? I don't know. You know right. what else rests in the lobe? Creativity. Individuality. Personality. In short, what makes you, you. I'm just about through now. Last chance, pet. Where is the ace in the home? Or what? 
What, you'll put a hole in my head and take away my memories? You want to make me forget all this? You want to make me not care anymore? Go ahead. You'll be doing me a favor. Oh! Bring in the monster! You're a regular hero, ain't you? Can't risk ripping the only part of you that's worth the damn. Well, there's more than one way to fry an egg. Now, little woman, are you familiar with the term transorbital lobotomy? Please let her it's go! It's a simple matter. All I need to is insert this pick in please, your eye. Please, I don't know and anything! a few I... taps with me hand. I don't know anything! Better to show by example. Please! Please don't! I, I don't know anything! I, I don't know! Please! Tell him what I don't know. Where are we? You saw all the doors. And what's behind all the doors. The ace in the hole. It's here. Yes. But, but I don't... I don't remember this place. You've never been here. Then how would the I... The memories you lost, they weren't just of the past. You saw behind all the doors. Even the ones into the future. going if you want i i don't like it here it's a bad place he's never gonna let me go is he even if i bring him the ace then why am i here how if i was so smart if i saw so much why just send myself to the slaughter for sally no one day he will just rip her open and tear out her atom all of this for nothing why did I do it? Why? You have to decide. Decide what? To take a leap of faith. I can't tell you what you were thinking because you don't remember. But you chose to come. There. In that room. The Ace. I don't know what to do, Booker. I... B Booker? Booker! No, please. Please just don't leave me here! Chung's clinic. That's a bit convenient now. Ryan's got every turret in the place tuned to me and me man's genetic code. We'd be torn to shreds before we got ten feet. That's right. Which is why I'm gonna do it for you. You okay with that? Get me the ace. I'll wrap the brat in a silk ribbon. Bag her and bring her to my bathosphere. <sighs> I'll show you how to get inside. <coughs> we'll be waiting for you where you come out. Shake a leg now. The Lord hates a laggard. Can you just 
Move a little bit for me, don't... I, I don't know how to help you, I... I don't. No, he's... He's just hurt, he... He just needs somebody to, to, to figure out how to fix him. I, maybe there's some... I don't know. Is there some documentation for him around here or something? Who I'm asking. Daddy will not imprint. If not imprint, what good is he to little sister? She no like him. He no like her. Situation is impasse. Unacceptable. Stupid beast had half brain. They would realize they need little sister to live. Sisters secrete only kind of atom that is genetic match for them. No little sister. No big daddy. Scary, 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 scary. I've got to do something. Big monster sick. Monster it's okay, sick. it's it's okay, please. I, I don't know how to help him. He needs Adam. I, I don't have any of that. I, I don't know what to do. Going to die. Not fair. We can help. Of all the things I know, I know this. It is in your power to be a different man. What can Ryan take from us that we have not already sacrificed at the altar of discovery? They are children, little sisters, and yes, they will forget. But you and I won't. The memories of what we have done fade only with the dimming of all lights. the genetic sequence to uh, sure. uh, sequence to allow for get away you filthy little shit This is it. 
This is the ace in the hole. All the pain and all of the death for this. Sister, over here. Do you have it? I have it. Give it over then. I'm keen to get this brat off me hands. You know what? Andrew Ryan said I was a rube. But he was wrong. I'm not the rube, Atlas. You are. No. We both know what happens next. Just get it over with. Well, love, if you insist. What's this? It's just a bunch of gibberish. What, what does, does this say, say, you little whore? Hey, hey, hey! What does this say? We've got the activation phrase. Now all we've got to do is get that genetic freak of nature on an airplane and rapture's ours. Yeah! Save the world entire. This is you who are the safe. Ma 